Hey guys, what's up? I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to uh, boot up your jailbreak, uh, DSI Fire School jailbreak. Uh, this is a jailbreak I've been working on for quite some time. Uh, I haven't gotten to it because some stuff is going on, but um, I'm going to show you how to install installation of how to do this. Uh, this installation, I've already had this installed, but I'm going to reinstall the jailbreak for you guys just to just show you all what it does. Um, this is a real jailbreak, this is not a fake. Um, go ahead and go to your web browser. This installs on your uh, any, any DSI. Um, it works for XL too. You can install this on the XL browser also. So what you're going to do is you're going to press... Um, I'm going to delete the jailbreak real quick. The jailbreak is deletable. It can be deleted anytime. No mess ups. Does not mess up anything. All you have to do is delete it. So now... Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this go-to page, and you're going to type in HTTP tinyurl.com slash DSI Joe Break uh, Fire School. So on this Joe Break, um, you are going to have to restart your browser on this Joe Break. I'll show you guys why. So, um... Yes, the jailbreak will be installed, and you'll start seeing a bunch of ads. Um, it's going to do that, so I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. Hello, um... Trying to get it to focus. Maybe it's not focusing. Okay, there it goes, it focused. Okay, so, um, you're going to see all this crap. Um, it's going to tell you the following website failed to correctly identify itself. Uh, it's going to say all this, um, the certificate has expired, go ahead and click OK. Click OK on that pop-up, and once you click OK on that pop-up, you should be good to go. So, uh, once you do that, read all that, and then click, if you can see that, download a jailbreak right here. Click on download jailbreak. So you're going to install this. Install your drill break from on your device here. If it's going to load up. Okay. So now you are in the screen. And you're going to see pop-ups. You're going to see a... I told you. See? You're going to see a bunch of pop-ups. Go ahead and click it out. Keep clicking it out. Installing. Alright. It's going to install... It's still installing the jailbreak, adding tweaks and modifiers. Still, it's still in installing the jailbreak to your device. And as you can tell, same thing. Click out. All right, so you're going to see the screen again, and it's going to tell you the jailbreak is complete. Here it comes. Um, here it is, jailbreak complete. Uh, it's going to show jailbreak complete on there. Click out of that. It's jailbreak complete. Wait to be redirected. Favorite to install your jailbreak so after that in comes up what you're gonna do alright here's one thing guys I gotta show you so go ahead click out of this again go to um, this click here there you're gonna see add page you're officially jailbroken on your Nintendo DSi browser you're, it's officially jailbroken so yeah use jailbreak to DSi um, this is a real jailbreak. I'm not even lying with y'all. I update this regularly. I have people that do it all the time. This is not fake. So, um, go ahead and close out. Um, if you try to install a package, it will not let you. Let, I'll go and show you. Because you have to restart. As you can tell, look at that. It will show an ad no matter what you do. If you try to click it, it will show that. So that's just like a jailbreak, um, it's going to show an ad popping up, I'll show you guys. If you try if you try to get on there, no matter what you do, what you're going to do, click the power button on your device. Alright, click the power button off, turn your DSi back on. Alright, so now turn your, DS, turn your DSi back on and off. Okay, so now let's go back to the jailbreak. 
Uh, now, uh, it's going to load up. As you can tell, it did not do the uh, anything else. And when I click the old packages and show you, you guys can see that. It's not going to let me show you, but click on it. And there you go. There it is. You're on it. As you can tell, I'm accessing it. Um, I can go to in the package. I can in install packages. Um, packages work, as you can tell. I just installed a package right there. And go ahead and click the delete. This is for the Apple screen, by the way. Go ahead and click the delete button for that. And basically, you have it. So now when I first, when I first go into the jailbreak, you'll see this screen pop up the Apple load screen um, pop up and it will redirect you to the jailbreak hold up seconds okay there you go and it takes you here so basically there you go um, sources work everything is working fine um, nothing is working again you can download sources here sources page um, you can there's a lot of sources I'll show you guys how to do the sources okay let's say um, a source name now you're saying how uh how do you do that okay well you see this right here i'm changing that to source list so i'll put sources right there you can get sources from the forum i'll be posting them right there the forum uh we have some now has some new stuff coming so get ready for that and go to the sources right there and uh let's say if, it, if it's like um ds alpha all you do is you type in, let's go here, and you just type in the source name. You type in, you don't type in anything else, but just type in, let's see, uh, DS Alpha. Yeah, just type in anything you want, it doesn't matter. And type it in, and you just click the search source. It will generate from the jailbreak, and it will find that source. Um, that's basically it, guys. Um, and you're jailbroken, so... Thank you guys for watching. I'll be updating this regularly. Um, yeah, that's about it, guys. It's basically a drill work for your DSI. And see you guys later. Goodbye.